Let's talk about the the big W. First off, what were you and Odell talking about on the sideline? Who sent that to me? Maybe my like, mom? Yeah, I was curious. Do you know? I assume you know because you were tagged or texted. You know, not being on Twitter, I don't see everything. But I do, if you type in certain stuff on Google, which like... Not, so you're off Twitter, you're just Googling yourself? I Google. So yesterday, I did I... I was... Okay. So yesterday... Obviously didn't play. And, you know, I've, there's a, this, is a, this could be a longer, store, short deal. First off, I was, the Rams, dude, first off, the Rams stadium is, it's just something about it just looks so pretty, so nice. It's, it's like, so nice. I think, do they got LED lights or something? They well, got I, the screen. It's the... like something about it just looks like, I just want to touch it. You know what I mean? It's just something really nice, whatever. So I walk out there and I didn't realize, like, I went to the Super Bowl the one year. Yeah. But I was sweet hopping, and I was lost the majority of the Super Bowl. Flex, flex. I was lost, probably. No, no, no. that stadium is the, impossible to get the, around. The, the people, I don't know how I was getting in these suites. They also pump in crazy noise. It's I so did, loud. Dude, in I there. didn't feel like they were cheering up. So anyway, I'm seeing the screen, and I'm like, why is number 18 in for the Raiders, and Marcus Peters isn't? So then I type in Marcus Peters, and on Google, you type in someone's name, I guess if they're relevant or they're trending at the time, X pops up at the bottom. Yeah, yeah. And realize he got he got benched. It's kind of sorta. Well, they're not kind of sorta. I hear they might cut him today. Might be a Marcus Peters reunion. Probably not. But anyway, what was I talking about? <laughs> what you and Odell were? Oh, you Google yourself. Oh, I was talking about Odell. So that that was Twitter. Okay, that's why I said that because that really had nothing to do with anything. <laughs> but then, as I was still out there for pregame. EDC told me this really funny story that I can't tell you <laughs> about one of the announcers last night. So there it is. There's okay. how many ever announcers? Maybe there's three or four. It's a funny story. It was really more so funny because EDC got bullied basically by one of the guys, essentially. Don't quote me on that. Thirdly, as I was sitting there on the sideline, I realized, man, and this is and this is real spill. This is real spill. You know, when James Winston had that quote, he was like, I realize. I don't like football. I like playing football. <laughs> it's not really fun to not play football. It's, it's, it's a little bit, not even a little bit. And I'm not, it's a lot bit. You know, you're just like, mm, you can cheer. You're a fan. You're a fan. Yeah. You're a fan, but you're- And you could be playing. You're, you're a fan. Like, you know, there, there's- there's a whole bunch of fans, Ravens fans. There's a whole bunch of whatever your team is fans. But they can't just get out there on the field. <laughs> I can get out there on the field, but I'm not out there on the field. And honestly, it's, you know, is it mental health week? Because it's a little bit depressing. But got to stay positive. Got to stay positive. You got to stay positive. Now, I gave all that stuff for no reason. It had nothing to do with the question <laughs> at hand. But those are my thoughts. A little bit depressing. Ram Satan was cool. EDC, That's got, what's on your mind. EDC got bullied when he was younger, been with the Ravens for a long time. And we talked a little bit about fulfillment, which is my ongoing question. Fulfillment, are you fulfilled? Mm. I had a very long, lots of chats yesterday with people. I see that. Team Chaplin. Whew. All right. Back to Odell. Whew. Yes. Is that? I saw that clip. <laughs> I had a towel. And, you know, I don't be like, when you're on the sideline, you don't know you're on TV. And you don't really ever think you're on TV, but I do just, I'm happy how to tell. I wasn't saying anything crazy, but we were, we were, we were talking about some stuff. You're going to make everyone sit through 10 minutes of your day in LA. <laughs> and that's what you're going to tell we, us is you were talking. We, we were, we were, we were, we were talking about some stuff. We were talking about some stuff. nothing crazy, nothing crazy. Is there anything you can share? <laughs> no. Let's see here. Let's see. If it wasn't that crazy, I feel like. Yeah, 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 yeah. Or maybe it was that crazy. We just talked about basically, long story short, if something's working, why change it? Mm. And getting going about me and Mr. OBJ, which he really has gotten going. Yeah. The past, you said you know, that. The past two weeks. Hey. You said that. You know what I'm saying? But hey, but peaking at the right time as well. You know, all we just. It was a short combo, and he wanted to play more, but you know, banged up a little bit. I was yeah. like, "Bro, bro, they taking care of you, bro. Just chill." 
You know what I'm saying? They taking care of you, bro. You got a shoulder, you know what I'm saying? You OBJ, we good. So it was a, it was a, it was a we, we, good combo, good combo. Okay. Like, like the OBJ guy. Like, he's a good guy. Good yeah, guy. good guy. Good, good Maybe guy. coming good on the show soon? OBJ will be on Punchline Pod. Hey, hey, the cat's out the bag. The cat's out the bag. All right? Yeah. Yeah, so make sure you hit subscribe so you don't miss that one. Yeah.